This is a quick lesson on how to change your name on Zoom. For a tournament, your child will need their four digit number, their first last name, and then the parent first name. So if I'm going to change my name, which is Renee LeBlanc, you're going to want to find your video. I'm finding my video. I'm clicking on the three dots. I'm going to go down to rename. After I click rename, I'm going to put my child's four digit number for to compete at tournament. I'm going to put their first name. Gabby LeBlanc, and then my name, which would be Renee. When I hit rename, you'll notice that the number's here, Gabby LeBlanc is there, and then if I made it larger, it would show uh, my name as well. Now, when you're on a phone, it's a little bit different. On the phone, you're going to want to click on somewhere in the dark area, Click on participants, then click on the one that you want to change, and then say rename. So I'm going to change that to just another fictitious number, another name. Let's just say Mary is going to be the mother. I'm going to click done. And you'll notice down here where the pie is, the, num the numbers come on, the first, name, first and last name of the student, and the parent is there. So. On a video, just click on the three dots on your computer. On the phone, you're going to have to click on participants and then change it there. Hope you enjoyed this quick lesson. All right, this next brief lesson is going to be about joining a breakout room. When we're ready to begin the tournament, we'll let everyone know that the breakout rooms are open. You'll see this little symbol in the bottom of breakout rooms pop up on your screen somewhere. On your computer, it'll be on the bottom right. On your phone, it should just pop up. One thing you'll need to know is the breakout room you're assigned to. And that breakout room is the last two digits of your child's number. So my child, Gabby LeBlanc, her breakout room is room 3 because it's a 03. If there was a 23, I'd have to go to room 23. Uh, I've got both of my accounts that I'm signed on to today, the exact same name. So the host knows that both of these should be in the same room, should be in room three. To join the room, you'll just click on breakout rooms. You'll go to room three. To the right of it is a blue number. You'll just click join. It'll ask you. You just confirm that you're going to that room. Now, we are in breakout room three with the computer. So I just have to get the phone over there. For a phone, it should just have the breakout symbol. Click on the breakout symbol, go to the room you're supposed to, and then you'll see that popping up in just a moment. And there is the game board. One of the things you really need to be careful about is the positioning of your game board. It might not be the same from the main room to the breakout. So if it's not the same, you're going to need to readjust your camera to make sure it is the same. So after adjusting the camera to make sure that the game board is in the correct format for both fantastic leads to see, one thing you may find, you might not be able to see the game board large enough. There is a view option on the top right hand side. You can do speaker view, which will put one of them a little bit larger. You're not sure which one, if it's speaker view. You can do gallery. You can also do full screen, or you can in the video you want. I really want to see the game board large. So, and this is only for the person who's viewing it. So if the person viewing it clicks pin, goes to the three dots up here, clicks pin, then you'll notice that the game board is a lot bigger and the viewer should be able to see it clearly now. 